But I'm up here in this room right now that I don't think I've ever vlogged in before, but we pretty much have this here. I'll show you. We have this pretty big room in my house that has a lot of like workout equipment and stuff like that. And there's honestly like a lot of room in here um, to do like at home workouts and stuff. So yeah, we have like a lot of little things that we can use to work out but i feel like i never like work out in general but i feel like i really need to utilize this room and this space that i have to work out so that's what i'm gonna do right now i don't have anything else to do so i figured i would do like a little at home workout um so i have been on youtube and i typed in at home workouts for women welcome back to another video today we are going to be doing a 20 minute full body workout. okay i'm just gonna set my whoops i'm gonna set my computer up here on this little table and i'm just gonna stand here and do exactly what this girl says to the side seems a little bit silly but you really need to get your body moving keep those arms nice and strong don't forget to engage the core and also be strong with those arms. Dude, I forgot to bring my water up here and I'm already kind of out of breath. Mind to muscle, focus on those muscles. I feel like I also engage. never engage my core. Like, I never know how to do that. Is that weird? Alright, now we're going to take a quick oh my God. jog in place. Engage that core. How do you engage your core in your jumping jack? I don't get it. Very easy. Y'all, that was hard. I feel like it really wasn't that hard. It just, I just never work out. So for me, it was like really difficult. But I think I'm definitely going to come up here and do more workouts every night just because I feel like my body needs, like, some muscle back. So I'm going to start doing this, like, every day, I think. Not this specific workout, but just coming up here and, like, working out. I think I'm going to do some weightlifting in addition to, like, a normal YouTube workout just because I feel like I need to, like, you know, strengthen my body. And also, does anybody have any tips for engaging your core like how can i engage my core better because i feel like that's the one thing that i am horrible at because every time i do any type of ab workout my back kills me like it hurts so bad so if anybody has any recommendations that would be amazing but this girl mad fit um i'm gonna subscribe to her because she was really good and i like that little workout Okay, I'm gonna down this entire water. This was the old size. That used to be this size. That's the old size of the kids meal. Oh my god, that's so little. You can't even tell on camera. <laughs> <laughs> we got the Bojangles, Kid Supreme, French fries, and I hate when they give you Dijon. Wait, isn't Dijon the same thing as regular honey mustard? Dijon. Dijon. <laughs> there she comes. The strings singing do a di 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 dum di di di. I forgot about that song. You look good, look good. She looks fine, look fine, and I'm gonna make her mine. <laughs> I thought I did. <laughs> look good, she look fine. Now I really lost my mind. God, look how big this she comes, just a walking down the street, singing do a di 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 dum di di do. Turned out to be a pretty day. Hopefully I'll get a tan. Let's see what the UV index is. It is a six. That's not that bad. Not that good either, but not too bad. the most fun ever with a visit to the Seattle Cannon Village, 105 Soccer Path Road in Atlantic Beach, serving the Crystal Coast for over 50 years. Visit us online at seahawkin-villas.com.
the water running in the other room here I'll shut this door but I am gonna take a bath right now like I'm actually gonna sit down in the bathtub and relax and right now I'm gonna take my makeup off really quick with a face wipe because I actually wore makeup today because I had an occasion to wear it um but yeah I don't think I've ever vlogged in this bathroom before either, but here we are. It's a little half bath. It's really cute. It's just very small. Um, and there's one of these little sinks in here, which is really cute. So, yeah. I just think this uh, bathroom is really cute. So, I should start vlogging in here more often, but I am going to take a bath and have a little relaxing night. And I also brought one of the chairs from the kitchen into the bathroom. And I'm going to prop my computer on the chair. And watch Pretty Little Liars while I am in the bathtub. I had a lot of mascara. Oh my gosh. Which actually this is from... I used this today and yesterday. Because I don't like to go through too many of them if I can help it like if I'm only wearing mascara you know it's not like necessary to throw a whole entire wipe away so anyway I think that's as good as it's gonna get I just wanted to get my makeup off as best I could before I got in the bathtub because I thought that was kind of gross to have like a full face of makeup on but yeah okay let's get a check on this bath because it might be overflowing for all I know. See, here's my chair. Oh! We have a nice little bubble bath going on. And then I have my computer right here with my water. And then I have this covered up with a towel so it doesn't get moisture in it or anything like that. Ooh, this is kind of like a little self-care night. We got the full setup right here. These are the vitamins that I've been taking. They're called Lysine. Um, Y'all know I get really bad cold sores slash fever blisters, whatever you want to call them. And these, I heard, can help if you take these like every single day. Then it kind of like prevents you from getting any cold sores. So I've been doing this for about two weeks and I haven't had any. So, so far so good. I'll keep y'all updated on how I like these. But so far I really like them. I haven't had any type of fever blister for about two weeks so that's good also made my iced coffee this morning i'm almost done with it but i wanted to show you all the creamers that i just got so i've been using the starbucks creamers this is the white chocolate mocha one i have not used this one yet but i love the white chocolate mocha from starbucks so i'm probably gonna love that and i also love the top look how cool this is you just go like that and pour it so that's kind of cool but this top's like a normal top you just have to Go like that. But anyway, this is the Starbucks Caramel Macchiato Creamer. And this is the one that I've used. And I love this one. So, it makes the coffee really good. And it makes it taste like exactly like Starbucks. Like a real thing that you would get at Starbucks. So, I've been loving these. I've still been using the regular Dunkin' Donuts cold brew to make this. But this is the creamer. 
And I'm also watching Pretty Little Liars. I'm on season two, episode one. I've seen the whole show before, but it kind of got confusing to me towards the end. So I'm re-watching it and I literally am obsessed all over again. High school me is dying right now. This is my favorite character, right? Him, Caleb. Love him. Y'all need to watch this show. If you've never seen this show before, it's honestly so good. Um, Caleb, my favorite character, he doesn't come in till like probably halfway the first season. But there's like, yeah, there's 22 episodes in the very first seasons, which is kind of a lot. Plus, they're all like 45 minutes long. So, highly recommend Pretty Little Liars if you like a little thriller mystery situation in your life. Okay, so I just got done filming a week of at-home workouts. Well, I'm not done with the video, but I did today's workout. So if you are interested in seeing a video of at-home workouts for a full week, make sure to subscribe and stick around. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and end off this video. Gosh, my makeup looking rough. Um, but I hope you guys like this video. Make sure to subscribe, like the video, and follow me on Instagram. And I will see y'all in my next